Jay, tonight it is clear who the next mayor of Wichita will be. Between mayoral candidates Jeff Longwell and Sam Williams, Longwell will be the new mayor of Wichita, coming in with 59% of the vote. Williams received 36. Cakes Lily Wu just spoke with the new mayor elect, Lily. Well, a very exciting night here at the Monarch for the official Jeff Longwell watch party. As you can see, dozens of supporters are still out here cheering on Jeff Longwell, the new mayor of Wichita. Now, the phone call came just before 9 p.m. from Jeff Longwell's opponent, Sam Williams, who trailed behind all night. Now, within minutes, he announced to a cheering crowd that Williams conceded in that race. Now, throughout the night, Longwell appeared in good spirits, smiling, chatting, and talking, taking photos with supporters. Several notable leaders in Wichita and businessmen like Bill Warren came out to support the eight-year council member who is now named the new mayor of Wichita. We're pretty excited. We're looking forward to leading this city, and we know we have a number of challenges, but we're ready to take those head on, and we have a great group of elected leaders to do that with. So uh, we're looking forward to what tomorrow brings, and, and uh, you know, tonight's just uh, full of excitement and overwhelming enthusiasm, and we just feel truly blessed, but we're ready to take on those challenges. Again, the crowd here cheering for Jeff Longwell. He received more than 8,700 more votes than Williams. And tracking the Williams watch party is Madeline Anderson. Well, it was a disappointing night here at the hotel at Old Town where Sam Williams and his supporters watched as those results came in. You'll see behind me that the crowd has completely cleared out for the night. Williams conceded to opponent Jeff Longwell just before 9. Williams thanked his wife, the people who worked on his campaign, and the voters. He says as a businessman who's never been in politics, he's proud of his campaign for starting the conversation about transparency in government in addition to pushing for job creation and improving our city's infrastructure. But he says it was that lack of political experience that also hurt him in the long run. He says he and his family weren't prepared for how tough and sometimes nasty politics can get. Uh, you know, I'm, I'm not a politician. I was a first-time candidate and running against a, for someone who's been an incumbent for a long time. Um, it's, a, it's a tough thing. And as the, as the campaign went on and the messages became less and less uh, differentiated, I think people go with the name they know. Now, Williams says moving forward, he and his wife are going to enjoy being retired for a while before deciding how they want to continue to serve the Wichita community. Reporting live in Old Town, Madeline Anderson, Cake News.